Hey guys and welcome back. I hope you're having a great day. Uh, I've been sick for the last four days, so I'm just getting back up and running and getting going here. I actually have to tear apart my mower. I'm almost done. I'm not gonna work on this long, but I have got a whole mess. As you may know, I'm always working with ropes and cords and sometimes there's pieces laying in the yard. Well, what happens is those pieces get sucked up into the mower blades and you'd think they just cut right through. But the rope's so strong and so small that it gets inside the blade like this and it just riddles these parts. It'll literally bend all this metal out and it makes it so it grinds until it won't spin anymore. And then you get to tear the whole thing apart like I'm doing now. So basically what I've got, I've got this one done, new pulley, new center core. I'm just about to bolt this one up. New, and I still gotta do this one. As you acquire more things, nice things, junk things, crap things, it's like this storm of maintenance that builds up. It's like you work all day and then you gotta mow your grass. Well, if your mower breaks, then you gotta fix it. Or you gotta make an enormous amount of money to pay someone to have somebody else fix it. In my case, I fix everything, so I do it myself. But you have to learn everything you can now so that you can fix all this random stuff. I don't care if you're a computer programmer or if you're a doctor, a scientist. Uh, physical hands-on knowledge is gonna be required no matter what. So I, it's definitely worth your time to know how to work uh, a wrench, own a toolbox, own a tool set. Here we go. I've got to take this, stick it in here, run these bolts through, and these bolts will actually self-tap the holes. These aren't threaded. I know you guys are thinking right now, you're making fun of my Finding Nemo Band-Aid. Well, this morning, my knuckles got cut, and I was like, hey, go grab me some Band-Aids, and this is what the kids brought me, so that's what I got. Okay, that's done. Now, I didn't think I needed new blades, but look at this. The blades are hit, so I gotta get the angle grinder out. This, is, this one's probably actually the worst, because it hit a stump and broke the pulley off, and that's what ultimately shut it down, but... Guys, I don't really think you want to watch me fix this mower, so I'm gonna go ahead and fix this. And I'll see you in just a second. Hey guys, just want to take a second to uh, show you the pool. Uh, they had to rip it up, replace the liner, do stuff to the bottom, do stuff to like all kinds of stuff. But they got it back up and running. Sorry, I've been sick. I was gonna plan on doing like you know more videos, but I was so sick. Uh, here it is. It's looking better. I had to refill it on my well. So a day ago, this was like blood red from all the iron from the well water because it comes up out of the ground with iron in it. Pretty cold, looked like a swamp yesterday, but it's looking good now. I am on my way over to my parents. Uh, Roman's over there. I'm stopping by, just do a quick little thing, and then I am off to the music shop. All right, so we're already driving in the car. I'm almost to my parents' house. Uh, my family's not with me. They are actually, unfortunately, sick, so they had to stay behind. I'm meeting up with Roman. Uh, I brought a little project over for him and uh, his channel. It's gonna be fun. I've been waiting a very long time to do this. I've done it once before off camera, and uh, it's really fun. I'm sure people have done it uh, a bunch, but it's pretty cool. And actually, the last time we tried it, a guy about got knocked out from it. So, and it hasn't been windy like all summer. So this is like the first opportunity heading into fall that we have plenty of wind here in Ohio. So we're gonna do it. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> 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 oh, dude, that was awesome. Hey, just wrapping it up from here. We had such a blast. Time got away from us. I think it's too late. I don't think I'm going to the music store. I'll probably just head home, do a movie night, game night, something like that. That was like so fun. Time got away. That was uh, over two hours. We were wrangling that thing. So, um, yeah, it's getting too late to go to the music store. I'll uh, pop in there first thing tomorrow morning and uh, take you along with me. I've always loved the idea of kiteboarding. Every year we go to the ocean and there's these uh, people kiteboarding out in the ocean. I've always wanted to do it. I actually I actually did it once. I took a class at the uh, Real Sports kiteboarding place. I sucked, I was terrible at it. I didn't have enough time to go back. Uh, I was just getting the hang of it when uh, we had to go in. It was like, we took a whole day and 
by the time my time was up, I was like just getting short rides and uh, definitely something I want to do more. There's actually a lake they do it up here in Ohio, but weather's got to be just right. So you like, you got to have time. Like you got to be able to bail from work when the winds are just right or whatever. With the parachute, there's just not enough control to make it stay up or over or left. So like it was really hard fighting it left to right and trying to keep it up. But uh, definitely a workout, great exercise. Welcome back day two. Sorry guys, I'm just running errands. I st I'm still driving here, but I'm at the hardware store and I got to get some batteries. Um, I've, I've got my dive equipment and the dive computer needs a new battery. All right, 2032, that's a super common battery. So I got the batteries I need. This one single battery, this, this computer takes two of these. These are $5 a piece. They had these in generic. They had 15 of them for $3 or one Duracell for $5. Normally I'd go with generic. However, this is going in a scuba diving computer. I figured I should buy name brand. There's $5. Two. Here we go. And we are ready to dive, woo! Shame there's no clear water around here. All right, I have to show you this. This has just blown my mind. Oh! That's insane. How did it go from that filthy to that clean overnight? Oh! That's insane. How did it go from that filthy to that clean overnight well I'm glad it's cleaned up and ready to go because we may only have like another week and I want to get it shut down and covered up before all these leaves start to drop I need like a backhoe to scoop all the leaves out of that pool if I don't get this thing covered up by the time them leaves start falling I have no idea where this vlog is going it's just like this crazy hectic I, I was trying to get up to the music shop I can't get up to the music shop now I'm back here back there I'm it's I'm like I'm in day two on this super short little vlog. Now, I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, so the reason I was trying to get up to the music store because I want to get a keyboard piano in the house so the kids, if they want to, can learn how to play the piano. Uh, this is the one I'm looking at. It's a Yamaha EZ220. And they had them up at the music store. I just can't get up there right now. So I'm thinking about just ordering one online. Between this one and a Casio, uh, I don't really know which one's better or not, and I think I'm just gonna roll the dice on one of them. In my last video, there were so many comments, what's that game you guys were playing at the end? Uh, that is a game called Chrono Bomb, and we just ordered it on Amazon. I'll put the link in the description for you. Okay guys, that's right, you saw it correctly. I just finished my application to set a Guinness World Record. I'll be the first one that I know of that I personally know to hold one if I can get this attempt. I didn't know anything about Guinness World Records and setting them. So uh, basically it takes like an eight week application process or something like that. That's like the general length or something. And it can be really expensive. Like if you want priority, it costs a lot of money uh, to get the priority application. And if you want to judge present, it's like an additional fee. Um, so I don't know what I'm going to end up with, but I just did like the basic application. I don't know, maybe they'll see this video, maybe they'll give me a little love, show me a little love, speed this process up. I'm not going to tell you what it is yet, but I am going to set one. Okay guys, this is the most unorganized, strangest, definitely, probably worst videos I've ever done. I don't know, um, but I got to call it quits. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.